Welcome to GardenWise Adventures. My name is Malie and today's time for another Plant of the Week video. We're going to do it, I don't know if you can see it yet, but we'll get you closer, on Moonshine Yarrow. Now there are many different kinds of yarrow. One of my very favorite is Moonshine and we'll show you what it looks like. Now before we get into what Moonshine Yarrow is, let's talk a little bit about all the other types of yarrow. Now, yarrow is classified as an herb. It has some medicinal qualities, and there are a lot of different varieties. I have yarrow growing all over, purposefully planted. And this yarrow will be blooming just a little bit later this season. Now the yarrow up here near my compost bins is going to be one of the first to bloom. Maybe it gets a little bit more sun. As you can see, there seems to be two different varieties. The leaves are a different color, the textures are different, and they come in different colors. The main one is white. These I think are a little bit pink. Now before we get to the moonshine yarrow, let me show you one other area where yarrow seems to thrive in my yard. And it's in my lawn. If you look really closely, you're going to see some of the ferny foliage in it. Now yarrow is one of the weeds that I really just like to leave. It's quite pretty. It doesn't crowd out the lawn. It always stays too short to flower because you know it gets mowed. But I think it's kind of fun to hide it there in the lawn. Let's see if there's a little bit more. It's kind of cute. Now moonshine yarrow is a little different than the regular yarrow. It's got much thicker, really just gray leaves. It's a beautiful color. Um, once these flowers are done, we will cut this back and it'll be just a gray mound. And it doesn't die all the way back over the winter so you get a little bit of that gray color. These flowers draw in the pollinators and they are an absolutely gorgeous color. They stay blooming for probably about four weeks. You can see all the little buds that are coming in after the um, buds that opened a while ago. Now moonshine yarrow is not really invasive. It does not spread out the same way the regular yarrow does. Your regular yarrow can become a little bit of a weed, but every once in a while, like this little baby right here, you will get some reseeding with the moonshine yarrow. Now I welcome this plant right here. He is in the way, but what I'm going to do is dig it up probably, I'd say the end of August when it starts to cool off a little bit and plant it in my new area in the front. So there I have a free plant. Now if you have an area in your yard that doesn't get a lot of water, has poor soil and kind of low soil fertility, Yarrow will thrive. It is very easy to take care of as long as you don't overwater it and over fertilize it. So, anyway, that's another one of my favorite plants. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, share it with your friends, and go have a wonderful garden adventure.